many LODs. Parallel, many view level of detail selection for real-time global illumination. In this work, we address the problem of efficiently rasterizing point-based geometry into many views, as required by several indirect illumination techniques. Our work is inspired by the classical point-based LOD algorithm, QSplat. As global illumination techniques require only a low-resolution rasterization, our point-based LOD approach, 12.9 milliseconds on the left, outperforms polygon-based rendering, 80 milliseconds on the right. With decreasing resolution, the advantage increases. At factor 2, 5.7 milliseconds versus 80 milliseconds. At factor 4, 1.6 milliseconds versus 80 milliseconds. Consider this bunny. We build a simple bounding sphere hierarchy on this geometry, which can be efficiently updated at runtime. Computing a cut for a single view means to extract the level of detail from the bounding volume hierarchy. When multiple views are used, we find all their cuts using a single fine-grained parallel approach. Once such a cut is computed, it can be rasterized, for example into the many virtual shadow maps required by instant global illumination. Here is a scene with a dynamic light source, and with more than a million surface elements. The resulting indirect shadow maps are of high quality in contrast to existing approximate solutions. Our algorithm works as follows. We start from a bounding volume hierarchy representation of the scene. Here, a simple binary tree. Let's consider computing the cut of four views in this example. We pair the nodes of the hierarchy together with the views resulting in the so-called node views. Then, we proceed in a number of iterations in which a single fine-grained computation is carried out. Split, call, draw, or merge. Two lists of nodes are managed by our algorithm. The first list contains all active node views which need further processing. It is initially filled with the root nodes for all views. The second list will be filled with all the node views that belong to the final cut. Note that each thread performs only a small task, feeding modern GPUs. Here is an animated character lit by global illumination, computed using our method. For incoherent motion, performance of our full version might vary. This can be solved by applying our lazy approach, as explained in the paper. In comparison, the lazy version on the left is perceptually equivalent to the full solution on the right. Natural illumination can also benefit from our approach. Now, an area light is sampled and many shadow maps are computed in only a few milliseconds. The light can be changed dynamically. The resulting shadow maps are displayed here. Further, our approach can be used for reflection and refraction mapping involving a high number of complex objects. For each object in every frame, an environment map is rendered which contains all the other objects. The maps are displayed in the inset figure. Now the environment maps are used for reflection and refraction mapping. 